coming to you with a new product that I've got. Now, this is not a new product on the market, but it's new to me. This is a very expensive product. It's called Polish Angel High Gloss. Now, this can be used as a drying aid, a standalone, um, a lot of different ways. Basically, we have the ceramic coated car and I just want high gloss out of it. I don't need a lot of durability out of this product, so I'm not gonna be clean and polishing this vehicle. That's what you would do, decon, clay, polish, and then apply this after you've done all that type of work. I just want high gloss out of this vehicle. It's got all the protection it needs, and uh, we're gonna use this to get it done. Before we get in the video, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button. Let's go. All right, so the car is already pretty glossy, as you can see, and uh, you know, I'm just a freak about extra gloss. Now we've just foamed the car and rinsed it, pulled it in and air dried it. And when you air dry it, the problem is little water spots like that. I don't know if you can see them, but I get water spots like that. So we're gonna use the Polish Angel as a high gloss topper and it's gonna take the water spots out. Let's get started with this process. All right, so we're gonna use the high gloss. We're gonna use an applicator. It's a microfiber applicator. Shake this product up. This product is about $100 for 500 milliliter bottle. If you used it on a standalone, you might get up to seven months, but being that this is already coated and I have other products on top, I would probably say I'm gonna get one to two months out of this, which I don't care, as long as the shine is there. We're gonna spray it onto the applicator. Look at that, it's purplish. You see that? And then we're gonna apply it onto the vehicle. Now you could use a towel if you want. If you want to spray this on the vehicle, you could do that too. Couple sprays right there and wipe it in. So however you feel like putting it on, that works best for you. This stuff smells good. I don't know, it smells some type of fruit flavor. Really nice. And it kind of has a little bit of haze on there as you apply this. So I'm gonna finish the other side of the hood and then I'm gonna come back and remove it. And I'll do a couple panels at a time that way. All right, so now we're gonna remove it. It's probably set on there for about three minutes. And uh, it went on really easy, guys. I am using an Auto Fiber Royal Plush towel. So this is a dual-sided, rounded edges type of towel. And uh, this does not lint. It is my favorite towel. So I'm just gonna wipe this off. And it's coming off really easy. This feels really slick, nice feeling. And we'll come take a look at it when I'm done with the whole car. We'll give it some time to set up.
found out a couple things about this product. It smells great. It goes on easily enough. Spray it on, wipe it on. But if it dries, it can be a little tough to get off. So what I've been doing is I'll put a, a spritz of water, one or two spritzes on the towel, and then I'll wipe, wipe it off. And that works just fine. No problem doing that because the gloss on this is really pretty amazing so far. There's definitely some, some things in here, some chemicals like polymers, silica, and titania. And those things will bond to this paint, even though I didn't correct it or anything like that. It's bonding to the top of whatever is on there. And it's going to work pretty good, I can tell already. So you just got to put a little water on your towel and wipe it off. Easy as that. I'm using this also to take off any dried water spots that were on there from air drying and it's doing a great job at doing that. Now at this point I've got enough on this applicator that it's a little bit moist so I can just go ahead and rub it right into the windows.
And for the rims, I've just got a, a wheel towel and I dampened it with water. And I'm gonna spray a little bit of this on there. High gloss, and I'm just gonna put it on. Take it off with the other side. Alright guys, well, did you like the video? What you think? Go ahead and leave some comments below. Hit that like and subscribe button for support. And let's talk about Polish Angel. So in this case, the car is pretty clean. I just foamed it, rinsed it, brought it in, air dried it. And the reason why I don't usually air dry it first is because you get water spots, at least where I live you do. And uh, I usually like to dry it with a towel and then go back over it with the blower and um, use a towel to spot dry any of the cracks and stuff. So of course there's some water spotting there. So we used the Polish Angel and we put it on an applicator and you can do it two ways. You can spray it onto an applicator or you can spray it on the panel. All right, you could spray it on the panel wet after you washed it, whatever you want to do, it's fine. But I, I did it both ways. I sprayed it onto, the car was dry. I sprayed it onto the applicator and I sprayed it on the panels in different areas just to see what the difference was. And in some cases you need to spray it on the car and in some cases it's easier to spray it on the applicator. It goes on easy. I didn't wait too long and I wiped it off. So as I started going around, I started to notice that wiping it off wasn't as easy as I expected. There's different chemicals in here that bond to the paint and they will streak, okay? Not a dark streaking like some of the SiO2 products. This has silica, this has polymers, and this has titania. Um, but it, streaks like a dried wax kind of in some areas. So about 80% you're gonna get off and you might have 20% streaking. So what did I do? I grabbed a bottle of water and I threw a spray and I wiped over it and it came right off. So that's the trick. A couple sprays of water, wipe over it and it comes right off. You could go around the whole car and then come uh, Come back afterward with your water and go over those areas and it'll work just fine like that i noticed some other areas i missed sprayed it came back later and it came off so other than that little bit of streaking this stuff is fantastic it smells really good um, it did throw a purple color onto this pad but then it wears off later on as you're applying it and it's not stained purple or anything like that. Your towels don't get stained, so don't worry about any of the staining. It doesn't stain. What I will say is that the car looks super shiny and glossy. Maybe the glossiest I've ever seen it. And it's like a hard shell gloss, not a warm gloss. It's a cold, bright and shiny gloss, especially in the LED lights or when I pulled it out and looked at what little bit of lighting we had in the sky. It's a hard shell gloss, if you get me. And it just looks sleek. So this bottle, this 500 milliliter bottle is about 100 bucks. I think a 200 milliliter bottle is about $60 or so. I got them on sale on top of that, right? So a little bit less than that. But I probably used one ounce for the whole car. And it's not a whole lot. And I even did the rims, I did them in the same way, except I just dampened the towel, sprayed it into the towel, and then wiped it off. I did the windows as well, so there was no problems with the windows. Um, I would show you a beading test, but the car's gonna bead no matter what, because I got protection underneath this. So this is gonna be, the car's gonna bead. We'll do some update videos 
when I rinse the car the next time. And uh, I think this is a fantastic product, probably not for people who are trying to make a lot of money, but if you have maybe a high-end car you wanna use this on, or your personal cars, and you want them to really shine and be glossy and look uh, gleaming when light hits it, or deep and dark reflective, that's a, key, that's a good word, reflective, very reflective. Uh, this is a good product here, guys. So I'd give it a, um, I'd give it an eight out of 10. I'd take one point off for the price and I'd take one point off for the little bit of streaking that you'll have to go through on the removal process. But if you can get by those, most of you probably will think it's crazy, the price. This is a fantastic product, guys. You should try this out, really, just for your personal cars. Thanks for watching, guys. I hope you liked the video. Stay tuned for more.